This video will show you how to take a picture from the internet and put it into Design Space to make a cut layer file. The first thing you want to do is find the picture you want and save it to your computer. Next, you want to go into Design Space and click on Upload, then click on Browse and find the file. Once you have the file, you always want to click on Complex. It will give you the smoothest, cleanest line. To erase huge chunks of all one color or the background, you're going to want to use the Select and Erase wand and Advanced Options. So if I leave the color tolerance at 16 and I click to erase the background, you'll see when you go to preview, there's a lot of jaggedness and nothing is really smooth about the image. So to get that to stop, you're going to want to increase the tolerance to 50 and then click on the background. Once it's high enough, you'll see that the lines all become smooth. You can increase or decrease this number as needed. Now you're going to want to erase all the colors that will be their own layers later on. So we'll take all the red. Anything that isn't black, you want to erase. Every now and then, you can click the preview button just to make sure that the lines are still smooth and you don't need to make any adjustments to your tolerance level. Zoom in for the smaller details. And last but not least, the background. Now that everything's erased, click on Continue and save it as a cut image. It's very important that you save it as a cut image. If you save it as a print and cut image, it won't let you make this without sending this to your printer. Click on Save. Once it's saved, you can upload it into Design Space and start the next step of filling in the colors. 